did it again. I was in the wrong direction and started talking. There we go. You get to look at me now. Instead of looking at the scenery. Sorry. Now, sometimes you get the bad with it. But I don't know what you're Decisions for trying to uh, decided to actually try to focus on my YouTube channel. You know, try to get it going a little bit. So I'm not gonna be going up on here now that much anymore. For a while, that thing's calmed down. But Instagram and Facebook, you're stuck with me. You know, but this live stuff, look at the look over my shoulder. Isn't that beautiful? That beautiful country there. Know. Things get warmer, I'll show you a lot more. Amos and I will go out to some of these metro parks we have here in Ohio. You can see some beautiful country, beautiful area. And if I'm not looking at you, sorry, I look where I'm going and I look at my dog once in a while. The biggest thing is, I always repeat myself, and many times I repeat myself, but enjoy life. You know, Days that I couldn't go out with Amos weren't exactly bad days, but there was always something missing. Now going out with him, I've got a little bit of enjoyment. Actually, though, I got a lot of enjoyment. But it's fun walking with him. You know, it's fun being outside, and he gives me even more of a reason to be outside. You know, because he needs it. You see my size. We're in a small trailer with really no property. So he has to go out on a rope all the time. So he doesn't get a lot of free time to run. So we walk, and every once in a while I take him out of the ball field. I know you've seen him. And man, does he have fun. Now if you're here, got a couple of geese that are letting me know I'm getting too close. I'm like a hundred yards away from them, but they still think I'm getting too close. No. And at any time you have a chance to enjoy the outdoors, please take it. Get off the computer, get off the game. No. Fortnite. Luckily, I haven't been able to load that. And I say luckily because it's becoming addictive. It's another one of those Everybody's got to play it, everybody does it, and it attracts everybody because you have multiple people playing at the same time. No? No, and, which, in a way is good, but too many people are getting addicted to it to the point they have to play it all the time. How is that fun? No, it's, it's not a business, guys. It's a game. It's a game you should enjoy playing. Not thinking you have to because you gotta win. What's the fun of that? Play it for fun. I hear too many, I see too many YouTubers, some of my favorite ones, playing the game. Gotta have a, gotta make a video of it. And it's like, I know it's the trend, but this is one of those trends. Fuck it. Really? It's not good for you. I really don't think it is. It's a game that everybody's addicted to, and I feel it, absolutely, it's an addiction, you know, and it's not right. You know, I really can't believe people are having fun, you know, playing it all the time. Gotta win, gotta win, gotta win. How is, how is that having fun? Really? You know, I've got, I've been games like that where I felt, but it wasn't those online games where you've got hundreds of people there, thousands of people playing it. So everybody sees what you're doing. So if you're no good at it, everybody sees that you're no good at it. How is that fun? Huh? How is it fun when a hundred people can see that you're no good at a game? No? I'm sorry, it wouldn't be fun for me. I'm not against the game. Don't get me wrong. But keep it as a game. No? 
you hear people, oh, I played it until 3 o'clock in the morning, 4 o'clock in the morning. It's like, why? I don't know. Maybe I'm just too old. You know, I don't see that as being fun. You play something for such a long period of time and then you get depressed. I might be acting, I don't know. But when you don't do good and you lose, you get angry or you get depressed or anything else. I just want to see people have fun playing a game is what it is. Okay. Now, other side. The walkout in the United States was yesterday. Fourth. Now, whenever I talk on here, or when I do a short one on Instagram, it's just my opinion. Please don't take it as I'm telling you to do something. And like, it's what I'd like to see you do. But if you follow your what you feel, and you use your rights as an American or anybody to voice your opinion, or to, you know, just by your actions, then do it. I'm proud of you. But please do it because you're honoring those that were murdered. Because I've heard, of, I've already heard of one place the people pulled a flag, American flag down and burned it. They better be in jail. Now, I mean that's ridiculous. That they, they, they should be in jail and expelled. Period. Then another one in Minnesota. A young man had a sign going, guns don't kill people, people kill people. And he was forced to leave the property and threatened with being put in a police car. Um, <clears throat> people, first better rights go both ways. If you're going to have a walkout, it better be a walkout that's equal. Not one that only goes one direction. I've argued this before. And it's not like in this school, it's a one direction walkout. Anti this, anti that. It wasn't for positivity. And a lot of these walkouts were get in front of a camera and harp, harp, harp. That is an insult to those that were murdered. Using those people as a platform for your agenda is cruel and very bad. And that's got to stop. You're going to get nothing done being that way. Nothing. Now, this is a long one for me, and I'm sorry I was into a rant a little bit, but I believe in this a lot. Stay strong, stay safe, stay happy, and stay positive. Always.